What's good sneaker fam, welcome back to our sneakers. And before I start this video, I do want to say I still have that I feel like our sneaker shirts for sale. So if you guys are interested in those, feel free to hit me up on Instagram, Twitter, in the comments down below. Or if you have my business card, you can hit me up there. The next announcement is don't forget to check out my vlog channel if you guys are interested in what I do during the day. But other than that, let's continue on with this cop or drop series. So today we do have three shoes and starting off with the first one, it is the Air Jordan 31 N7. And to be honest, this shoe is actually really nice. I saw it and I really liked it a lot. The colors really do like stand out, the white with the light blue and the black and then the little gray in the back. The blue makes the shoe pop a lot, even though there's not much of it. Obviously this is a basketball performance shoe and I've been wanting a pair of Air Jordan 31s for a while now, but I just like haven't got to it. I haven't got to buying them because I can't even play basketball right now because my hand is still messed up. So don't let me not having a cast fool you. So if I actually had the chance to test them out, I would actually cop these just because they're a really nice shoe. I've been wanting to try the 31s for a while. I heard they're really comfortable. They're really good on, on the court. So it would be something I want to buy. And if you're looking to pick these up, you can pick these up November 7th on the Nike sneakers app. Or probably you can also get them in Foot Locker, Foot Action, Champs. And probably East Bay Online too. A lot of stores carry the Air Jordan 31s nowadays. Oh, and I almost forgot to mention, these shoes are going for $185 before tax. After tax, it will come out to around $195. Going into the second shoe. This shoe is not 100% confirmed. It still says to be announced, but it showed up on this week's list and there wasn't many shoes, so I just like, decided to throw it in there. It is the Air Jordan 31 Singles Day. So basically what it is, as you guys can see in the picture, it's basically just an all red and black shoe, except it has hints of hearts and faces and basketball, I think. That's from, from what I can see. That's like mixed in, in the shoe and then you have some leather on the toe and then some suede on the side. Honestly, I like the shoe. It pops a lot, like the red and the black. Obviously, it's a really good colorway. But I'm not much of a Jordan 13 person, so in my opinion, I'd have to give us a drop just because I'm not a Jordan 13 person. And I feel like these shoes will sit on shelves. So if I, if I end up liking them, I'll probably like go and try them on and see what Jordan 13s look, look on my feet. But other than that, I'm, I probably won't even try buying them. And if you guys are looking to pick these up, you guys can pick them up on November 11th, which is four days from now, which would be Friday. Unfortunately, I don't have a price for you guys because I said TBA. So as of now, November 11th is the only date they have, but they don't have a price. So I'm pretty sure that will change and they will move it back. Last but not least, we're saving the most hyped shoe for the end, and it is the Air Jordan 12 Blue Suede. So as you guys can see in the picture right here, or if you guys have seen it somewhere else, you do know the shoe is mostly a blue suede. It's very dope. I know the suede probably doesn't like switch patterns if you touch on it like one way or the other, but suede is a dope concept on a shoe, especially on a Jordan 12, you don't see that much. And then you do have like that, I don't know if it's a gator skin, snake skin, I don't know what kind of skin it is, but you do have it around the toe box. And then on that you have like a shiny blue Jumpman logo, whatever you want to call it. I'm not much of a Jordan 12 person, so I don't really know the names for these things. And then the two eyelets at the top are also that nice shiny pearly blue color looking in my opinion the shoe is really dope i really like the concept but i'm not a jordan 12 person at all so for me this shoe would be a drop but i know a lot of people are trying to go for this this week and they do release on saturday which is november 12th and they're going for a price of 190 dollars. you can get them on the sneakers app i'm pretty sure you can get them also on probably foot locker champs and foot action i'm not 100 percent sure so don't take my word on it you guys can go check on their apps and see if they're actually releasing and if they are don't forget to reserve and get that good head start because that's key to getting the shoes from those three apps. So that pretty much sums up this week's copper drop. There really wasn't anything that's too good or too hype or anything nice in my opinion. But I know later on in November, there's a lot of good drops, especially towards the end, like around Thanksgiving and Black Friday and all that. There's Yeezys, Jordan 1s again, there's the babes dropping. And I will, of course, maybe be on that when the time comes. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe. You can also click right here, right around there somewhere. And click that to subscribe. Make sure you stay with us. Arsene signed out. Peace.